after a split um, with Rhode Island. Coach, if you could just start with your overall thoughts on today's performance. Um, I thought we had a lot of great at-bats. Um, we scored a lot of runs in the first game, and I just think it was unfortunate that it got dark because um, I definitely think we would have been able to battle those last couple innings, and, and it might have been different. But, you know, that's the way our game is. We, we got to five, and that's how it ended. What does it mean to finally be able to get outside on your home field, especially before uh, important conference games this weekend here? I think it means a lot, you know, everybody's dirt plays a little bit different, so so many times we're stuck inside, whether it was the snow or the rain, and we just want to be able to get out on our dirt and, and get used to it, and you want you want to have that home field advantage and just know how your field plays. Uh, in both games, the team put together really important rallies, game one late, uh, broke the 5-5 tie to get the win, winning game two, came down 5-0 deficit. Um, did the team make any adjustments, or what did you talk about, or, or what did you see during those big innings? Um, they were just trying to have more energy than the other team, and I thought that they came through with some clutch hitting, um, and they were just able to keep stringing those together. And lastly, just looking ahead to the weekend, who Albany is always a tough opponent in the conference, um, what are you expecting from them, and what are you hoping to see from your team? Uh, I want to see them keep playing like this. I, I think if we could do that, um, you know, it's a funny game. You never know how the ball is going to fall or what's going to happen. So they just have to continue doing what they're doing.